Hey, what's up guys? It's Zach. Get ready for an exciting video of me showing you my vending machine. GUI. I thought this image was kind of funny because it looked like me. But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> um... Let me pull up my IDE here. I use NetBeans. Let's run the program. I'm gonna hit F6 on my keyboard. You'll see that it's running here. It takes a little longer than I'd like, but when it displays, it looks like this. So you have your items here that you can choose, the user can choose from. Um, the user can click into the item and pick from the items within each category to add to their uh, basket and purchase. Um, once the item is added, you see this neat little pane pop up of the item dropping into a basket and it is added into the pane over on the right side here and it totals down at the bottom. <coughs> um, and some other items that I'm going to show you before I run my purchase queue. Uh, here is we're going to go back. First we're going to remove the Trident Candy gum from the basket. And we're going to go back to our category. And I'm going to show you the restock option. You have the machine one. You can see purchase order there. For the for machine one, go back and you can look at machine two. You can see everything there, total price. Close out of there. Um, this is the boss section. This is where the boss can log in and add and restock items to the vending machine. The password is. GCU. So we're going to type that in here. Click submit and it brings you to the inventory section of my vending machine. Um, here the boss can add items and they'll be updated to each category on the main display. So now I'm going to run the purchase queue. Um, to do that we click the queue transactions and you're going to see the program running and the output and my IDE in the background after it, it, after we click the Q transaction button, make it a little bit bigger here so that you can see the output as it's running. There are some exceptions that throw towards the end of it, but I'm working on trying to figure out what's going on there. Um, here's my purchase queue. You can see different types of names and items that each person is going to purchase. So here we go. Here you can see it running, it displays my customers up there, one by one, kind of coke, um, Pepsi, and it's removing it from the queue. But that's pretty much, uh, that's pretty much the whole vending machine for you guys. Uh, big issue that I, I came across, well, working on this project was trying to figure out how to connect my CSV files. Um, after watching countless videos and reading multiple examples, I was finally able to work it out and uh, get everything working correctly, semi-correctly. Um, 
But I hope you guys enjoyed my short video. Feel free to download my files by clicking the link to my Git repository. Uh, thanks for watching. Alright.